All right, so this is going to be a new snapshot for you guys today. If you guys, uh, I know I'm uploading snapshots back to back and I know I make videos every week, but snapshots just keep coming out and I am still late to them. But with that being said, there is some things to go into this snapshot. There is some changes, there are some changes and it doesn't have nothing to do with the mountain generation at the moment. Um, it looks like it does, but it doesn't. That's, I mean, cause that's, cause look at that. that. That looks like a good mountain. We have a new generation and that is be, uh, and that would be this right here. This right here is a crack in the ground. You guys are going to want to be careful because cracks now do spawn into the ground. They can go all the way down probably to Y, uh, zero, I believe they can go pretty deep and I would be careful because, uh, once you fall down in there, you guys ain't gonna. You guys ain't gonna have a fun time when you fall down in there and die and lose everything. New spawn generation, and, and that would be the cracks that are gonna be in the ground. They'll spawn everywhere in the ground. Trust me, when I say this, you guys are gonna wanna watch your toes when you when you're when you're you know strolling across your world. All right, and that's not all we have in the snapshot, but that's just a little minor thing there that happened with the world generation. So let's go check out the other stuff. So if we go into spectator mode, as you guys can tell, I think this is a crack in the ground. I think it's one of those because it goes all the way up to the surface or it could be a ravine. But as you it's it's it looks a little bit different than a ravine. There's a geode in uh, that spawned in there. So you guys would kind of be lucky if you want to get to that. But there you guys have it. Uh, that's a crack in the ground. These will spawn throughout your world. And that's what they look like. It's just it's amazing. All right. So here is the other parts of the snapshot uh kind of late to this i know this but um check out this cave nice cave really nice cave i can tell you that much uh that right there looking great you know we have some diamond you know and there's just a lot going on here so as you guys can see we have deep slate instead of grimstone grimstone has been changed to deep slate that's what they changed it. You guys are probably wondering, like, what's wrong with the ores here? I mean, they don't look like they're, they're, they're stone variant here. Well, that's because they've added a lot of extra ores in the deep slate variants they, uh, of that. And also, the original ores had some actual texture updates as well. We have coal here. We have copper, iron, lapis, redstone, emerald. Now, you guys can see that they... I mean, emerald looks kind of the same, but a little bit different there. I mean, you can tell redstone's obviously different. You can tell that's obvious. You can tell they're obviously different. Look at iron. As you can tell, iron has a lot, <laughs> a big, a big difference there. And so does this. I mean, it looks a little bit better, like oxidation. Of course, there's going to be copper ox oxidation on, on, on its ore variant. But as also diamonds, I, I, it still has like the original, um, still has the original the original thing here it looks the same there's no difference about it literally so that's why i didn't put it over here probably have already seen that these have a really awesome sound when you place them they sound so different it sounds like that block x game have you guys ever played that block x game from flash it literally sounds that it sounds like that and they also have a, a, a weird a, a, it's like it's i don't know it's like a nice sound so that's what it sounds like it sounds like that block x game i don't know why it sounds like that game but it does so this is deep slate obviously the replacement from grimstone uh, that's what it says in the change log on minecraft.net the texture changes for this we have the um, deep slate variants of the ores obviously the only different thing about the diamond one is that it's not stone and it's deep slate so that is that another small minor change is the so yeah the spore blossom creates an atmosphere when you're when you're next to it so you don't always have you don't have to be like exactly right next to it as you can tell i'm next to it but yet yeah, it's still creating an atmosphere next to it so uh yeah if whenever these come in to play and you have a cave the spore blossom will obviously create the atmosphere it's, it's kind of amazing it's kind of amazing at least at least it's not just in the area where it's at. It's going to just cre create particle effects around it in a um, block radius. Not sure what the block radius is, but when you obviously take it away, it goes away. So another addition to Deep Slate is that the ores are also take longer to mine than regular stone. So if I go and mine the iron right here, as you guys, as you tell, you grab the iron. There you go, iron ore. 
if I mine the iron just a little bit you can tell there's a little bit different difference there when you mine the deep slate uh, variant of the ores it's a little small difference but I am sure we'll be able to tell when the update comes out and we're mining we'll probably end up telling being able to tell how long it takes to get through damn caves underneath the ground <laughs> But right now, we are currently negative 52 down. So Deep Slate is negative 52 down. And as you can tell, there is diamond everywhere. You'll probably end up finding diamond a lot easier. So they need to find a way to make make it probably a lot harder to, to get. I will figure that out <laughs> when the update comes out. So there is another addition to the game. And when you go and mine Deep Slate underneath, you're going to get cobbled Deep Slate. This makes, I mean, I mean, it looks a little bit different, I guess. Kind of looks like a brick, a brickier version of it, I guess. Uh, but uh, yeah, you also can't put this in the furnace and it won't smelt back to deep slate. If you want deep slate, you're probably going to have to have silk touch on your pickaxe before you, you go mine, start mining deep slate. If you want to get deep slate, maybe that may be changed in the future. We don't know. But as of right now, if you mine deep slate, you're going to get cobbled deep, deep slate and it's going and you can't put it in the furnace. It's not like cobblestone. I'm pretty sure you can probably make pickaxes and furnaces with it because it's just like cobblestone. Normally with that stuff, it's obviously normally the same. Now you guys are probably wondering about the stairs slabs and all that. They've all been renamed to deep slate stairs, polished deep slate, all that stuff. It's been, I'm pretty positive it's been renamed. So yeah, as you guys can tell, this is a cobbled deep slate wall, polished deep slate wall, deep slate tile, deep slate brick wall cobbled deep slate stairs polished deep slate stairs deep deep slate tile stairs and so on and so forth you guys get the picture they've obviously been changed to deep slate as well because if it wouldn't make no sense if they weren't renamed to the block that they changed which was grimstone another addition to the game is actually down there's called a smooth basalt it is i'm pretty positive you you still get basalt from the nether but now, when you put basalt inside here and you let it, you know, kind of cook up here, then you guys are going to be able to get smooth basalt. Now, if I go and grab this again and we can compare the two, they look the same, <laughs> except for, I don't know. So this is smooth. This is regular. As you guys see, that looks different. Looks like it's a little bit different. Uh, I got, I, I, it looks like they just like, it looks like a weird version of cobblestone. I would say it looks like a weird version of cobblestone, but that's the smooth version of Bessel. Already guys showed you guys the spore thing as well. Can't wait. If I have missed anything in this snapshot, just remember I will make sure to go over them in the next snapshot with you guys. So I put on potion of night vision so you guys can see better because I want you guys to be able to see better when I show you guys the other thing in this snapshot. If you guys remember, there was a block called tough and it's usually around the geodes. They replaced that. They didn't replace the block. They repl and then it, and it's still around the geodes. I'm pretty positive. We already seen the geode, and it, it's, it was the tough block was around the geode, the amethyst geode. So now they've replaced. I think it was andesite with the tough block. So now when you guys are underneath the ground around the negative and the negatives, you guys are going to go and be able. You guys are going to be able to find some tough block. It's not a geode. It's just tough block. It's it's a variant underground. You guys will be able to find the tough block underneath the ground in this area. It makes it's a it, it makes it it's kind of a, a variant block. They've changed it. You will find it everywhere. I don't think you'll find andesite. You won't find dorite and you won't find granite in this area. You're only gonna find deep slate and tough. Now it's going to be a little bit tough. <laughs> no pun. <laughs> That was stupid. It's going to be a little bit harder to find geodes because now you're going to be uh, looking for uh, stuff and you're going to find tough and maybe you can dig around it. But I, I doubt that it's going to be a geode because they, it, this tough stuff is everywhere. Keep in mind that this is not a geode. It's just tough laid down on the ground. And I'm pretty sure you guys have gotten that. That is the snapshot for today. Uh, hope you guys like the snapshot. Hope you guys are excited for the update. And I will be, sh if I have time, let's hope I have the time when it comes out, 
uh, even if I'm a little bit late to the update, I'm still going to stream the update. So I'll, I'll stream 1.17 when it comes out and I'll show you guys everything that you guys uh, want to see. So that is the snapshot. If I've missed anything, I'll go uh, over what I missed in the next snapshot video. Now, I don't like posting videos back to back, but this is going to be a back to back snapshot video. I know my last video was an extra snapshot, but this is in this case, this is the uh, only video I have to make. So thank you everybody so much for watching. If you guys like the video, make sure to go down there and click subscribe. It helps me out a lot. If you guys don't want to, then don't have you guys don't have to simple as that and click the like button. And uh, yeah, as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.